The following will contain adult language and themes. Viewer discretion is advised. Thanks for watching. Call. Uh, Asuka's obviously taking a really hard hit. Call. You know, Are you there? Am I not here? Okay. <laughs> <What? laughs> Make sure um, I didn't drop again. <laughs> no, okay. Um, let's see. I can only move 20 feet, right? Uh, let me ask you this. Do you have any, you have snowshoes, you said, right? You don't have yes. cleats that you're no. wearing? Okay. Do you have anything that makes you move faster? Nope. Okay, your movement speed right now is 10 feet. Dang it. <laughs> All right. Um, hmm. I'm going to just move up. All right. And I'm I'm not really sure what I can do without hurting someone else in the process. So um knowledge check. Yeah. Let's okay. do that. And you still have a crossbow too. You can always use that as well. But yeah, do your knowledge check. But I'm but I might shoot the birdie. Well, it's not the bird's the, the bird's shoot? flying, so it's not a problem. Hmm. All right. This has ended badly for but, me every time I've used this crossbow. Okay, I was gonna say start with, your, start with your knowledge check though. Like, do your knowledge check if you oh, if you're planning. I can still know. do it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Okay. Uh, you get a little more information. Even um, you know that the yeti is intensely cold. And generally, anything that comes in contact with it uh, takes damage from that cold. Like anything that physically touches it uh, will take damage from from the creature. I'm going to assume that he doesn't feel cold. Um, well, that's good to know. And I can tell this to everyone, right? Yeah. All right. Hey, everybody! Don't touch it. It'll freeze you. Like that corpse over there. I mean, um, unconscious being over there. All right, I'm going to pull out my crossbow, I guess. Okay, and go ahead and, and I'm going to I'm going to attempt to shoot it. Mm -hmm. Who will I end up shooting instead? Okay, yep. Uh, that was damage. Uh, you want to roll your attack. Wait, oh, oh, crap. We'll keep Wait. that damage roll for later, but uh, yep, you're going to roll your attack roll, which is right next to the damage. Oh, okay, I see it. Uh, nope, that's not going to hit. Oh, of course it doesn't. <laughs> oh, I'm just going to sit here. Okay, Grazo. Question. Mm -hmm. Grazo has this cold resistance thing. Will it mm -hmm. um, protect itself from the Yeti's cold armor? Uh, a little bit, yes. Depends on how much it has, yep. Does it say 5, or what does it say? Uh, cold resistance 1. Okay. Uh, that means that uh, it will negate one point of cold damage when it gets hit by a cold attack. Uh, Garazzo seeing... Oh no, it says cold location. 5. It says cold 5 there. Uh oh. Yeah, uh, so Garazzo seeing a, a Acacia down will go behind the Yeti and attempts to use Claw okay. and make a bleed and get his attention away right. from the rest of the party. So you're going to roll your attack first. Uh. Nineteen. Uh, Nineteen will hit. Uh, go ahead and roll your claw damage first. Okay. 
Oops. Okay, I, there it is. Got it. <laughs> Took a few uh, clicks in order to get that. Sorry about that. Slash R one D six. Okay, so your cold resistance will negate all of that. Cool. Aslan, That's you're it. up again. Uh, what's Ninja's character's name again? Asuka. Is it possible I could drag Asuka back and use Stabilize on her? Uh, you can use Stabilize there, or you can try to pull with a Strength check. Uh, I would say you probably can't move much more than 5 to 10 feet, though. Okay. We'll go 10 feet. And where will I find this? Uh, well, a strength check, you just have to roll yourself. It's uh, slash R1D20 plus your strength modifier. Uh, if you're trying to pull instead, I'm sorry, if you're trying to stabilize instead, uh, you would do that uh, under heal, heal check, under, under skills. Okay. Oh, yeah, I have the spell. Uh, you have what spell? I'm sorry? I have the spell stabilized. Oh, okay. Yeah, if you're using the spell, then you don't have to roll. Um, sorry about that. Uh, let's see. Stabilize. It is instantaneous, one living creature. So, stabilized. Okay. So, Asik is still unconscious, but you're stabilized. You're not You're not in the process of losing any help. Ooh, not completely dead. Elbel, what would you like to do? Uh, how far can I go? Uh, do you, are you wearing plates? Uh, yes. Okay. You can move three quarters of your speed, uh, which is 20. Well, I'll, I'll go 25 feet. Uh, I move uh, behind uh, Asuka, and mm -hmm. um, can I use my the wand that um, I just received? Uh, you can, but it's so a here. cause. It's a it's an inflict wounds. Um, you can definitely do that, but it's an inflict oh, right, wounds. Right. Uh, and you did write that down, by the way. Yeah. Yeah, I wrote it down. Okay. Sorry. Uh, under possessions. Just want to make sure because I forgot to ask. Uh, but uh, yeah, that's a, it's kind of specific to you in that. Uh, Oh, come on, Kitty, that would have been funny. Um, yeah, it, it's specific to you because you react to negative energy. Um, since I took two damage from that landslide, I'll use it on myself to heal myself. Okay. Um, the, the one has 50 charges in it, so it's down to 48 or 49, and you'll roll 1d8 plus 1 and heal for that amount. <laughs> now you're stabilized, uh, Ninja. You're just kind of not... Conscious right now. Okay, so you'll heal back to full then. <laughs> it depends on how much I'm going to be. <laughs> uh, for healing purposes, eventually, maybe. <laughs> um, check. We'll get through this encounter and then we'll go from there. <laughs> uh, that's it for now. All right. Uh, Isaka, you're stabilized. Uh, she can't roll anything, right? Ninja? Or no, Ninja. Uh, no. Uh, nope. Yeah. Okay, I didn't think so. When so she's that's... stabilized and unconscious, so she can't roll anything. Yeah, she can't really do anything. Okay. So, the Yeti is going to... Since Grazo attacked last turn, or moved first and attacked last turn, that means that he's within 10 feet and he can be attacked by the Yeti. So the Yeti's going to attack the Eidolon. For 21. Does mm -hmm. that hit, Grazo? Oh. Uh, my AC is 17. Okay. So that so does hit. hit. Uh, so we're doing... 
36 plus 4. Uh, for 7 damage. Thank God. Okay, and he's actually going to attack a second time with his other claw. Uh, that's a crit. That's a confirmed crit. Wait, is that 21 of damage? For 11 damage. Uh, no. Okay. Down to one. And that's all he can do. All right. Now, how does this wand of shield work? Uh, you can use that on yourself or anybody else. Uh, the touch range Will spell. It only last one turn? Uh, no, I think it lasts uh, one minute per level, uh, which it's uh, one first level one. So, um... Wait, so it only lasts one minute or four minutes? Just give me one second. It will last uh, one minute per level, uh, but it's it's one minute, so ten rounds, uh, because it's um, a first level wand. Ten rounds. Mm-hmm. All ten, right. Ten rounds. Um... I think I'll be helpful somehow. Um, who is the lowest amount of health besides the unconscious, Asica? Uh, I think everybody took two damage, Grazo. so everybody's pretty... Well, yeah, Grazo is also pretty injured. At one health, right? Yeah, but you, yes. can't, you can't get over there this turn, or probably next yeah. turn. Um, alright, out of the bird, the cat person, and the weird guy, which one of you is most able to fight... <laughs> Lucian can't do anything in this. Yeah, who so are you talking about Lucian. when you mentioned the weird Elf guy? Lucian has full health. You. <laughs> All right, so birds out. It's got to be one of you two. Birds out, got to be one of you two. <laughs> who who can fight more against this thing? I guess I'll go. Uh, all right, you're getting a shield. You're getting actually with what I was planning on doing next, I might need a shield. Well, who's getting a shield? Thank give it to Aslan. All right, you're getting a shield. Um, Aslan most likely isn't going to be a frontline fighter. Um, your best bet, I think, is to put on Albel. But all right, Albel's getting the shield. If I may, <laughs> jump in there. Maybe the bird will get the shield. Alright, I'm gonna cast the wand of shielding on Albel. Okay. So your your AC goes up uh by plus four for ten rounds. Alright. I'll, I'm I'll, I'll call note you it. meat shield. I'll I'll note you it. You shall be my meat shield. Uh shield bones. There it is. What's your AC at right now? Um, there's a slight problem with shield. Okay. Um, because its range is personal, the person holding the one is the one that gets oh, the shield. Oh, okay. Effect. I thought that was a touch. Oh, All okay. Right. Fair enough. Okay, I'll so yeah, you can use an angel. <laughs> All right, I'm going to cast shield on myself. And, um, yep. I Can I do anything else or no? Uh, that's your standard action. action. You are, uh, you, did you move yet or no? You can still move. Um, well, I was over here, so I already moved, yeah. Okay. Ah, sweet. I got more AC. Ignore the weird noises. You're just brushing your hair. Okay, so you moved. Grezzo. You're pretty injured. Uh, it's somewhat injured. It's not looking... You know, it's not looking like it's it's, almost dead. it's 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 no, it's it's still moving pretty well. 
So it, you don't think it's gonna it's gonna take a, a little bit more damage, quite a bit more damage before it goes down. It can still take damage as one HP. Hmm? It has one HP, it's still gonna take damage. Right. Uh yeah, the Yeti is is can take a lot more damage is what I meant. Yeah. Oh okay. the Yeti is not ready to Yeah, Garazzo's looking pretty bad right now, but like how you say a lot more damage. <laughs> I retreat my garazzo. Okay, are you you're and, withdrawing? So yeah, okay. And that's fine. Go fly as high as it can. Yeah, the the with a Why withdraw can't... with a withdraw you can move uh, double your speed. Uh, as long as you're not attacking or doing any standard actions. If you're gonna do a standard action, then the yeti will be able to attack you before you flee. Wait, I was around here. Uh, yep, you're right up next to it. Double my. So double. So, so, so you, your options are: you can shift away from it, uh, which isn't going to get you very far away. You can withdraw, which means you can move double your speed, but you can't take any actions at all. Uh, or you can attack and kind of move like five feet, which it'll obviously be able to attack them. I'll reach. Okay, up to around here. All That's right, Aslan. Okay, so I'm gonna move up to here, and then okay. I would like to use touch of fatigue on the Yeti. Okay. Uh, I believe there's uh, gonna be a fortitude saving throw. I would imagine. Do you have the spell up right now or no? Uh. Yes. And what's the saving throw? It's a fortitude, I think. Probably. Yep, fortitude. So and we'll also a uh, touch attack. Yep. Okay. Uh, so, uh, no, you're not going to roll this fortitude. You're going to roll a, a regular okay. melee attack. Uh, not your dagger, but uh, the melee attack that's above the, the CMB and the ranged. It's kind of like toward the top of your character sheet. Okay, that is going to hit. Uh, so now he's going to have a chance to... Eight, he does not save, so the spell takes effect. Mm -hmm. That's to the Eddie, right? Yep, to the Eddie. <clears throat> Anything else you want to do? Uh, probably move back if I can. Uh, nope. You already moved this turn, so you can't can't move at all. Okay. So can I use my dagger on it? Uh, no. That would also be a standard action, which you already took one. So. Okay, so probably not. Yeah, uh, pretty much the only thing you can do is uh, like do a free action, like talk to somebody, say something to somebody else, uh, that type of thing. Inspire <clears throat> me to stay alive. <laughs> oh, all done? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> sorry. Uh, Elbel. Uh, uh, sorry, I didn't mention this before. Um, during the Yeti's turn, uh, does it take bleed damage? Yep. Before? Um, yeah, actually, I should have. I'll do that now. Okay. So basically a scratch. I move elbow up. Mm-hmm. Uh, Cal, are you going to be, like, coming up cl close to the um, Yeti and fighting? 
Um, probably not. I mean, if I if I keep shooting my crossbow, it's bound to work at some point, right? Uh, then I cast my uh, shield ally on Aslan. Okay. Can I still attack? Uh, yeah. Uh, no, you can't. Uh, if you're casting a spell, that's gonna end your turn. Okay. And. Hold on one second. I gotta look up what this does. Uh, shield ally. Okay, no, shield ally applies only to your idol one. You get a plus two armor class uh, to, to when your idol is next to you. Okay, never mind about my. <laughs> okay, what so I said. That's, uh, so that's not I just shoot it with my. Uh, uh, if you're standing next to it, it, you probably want to attack with a melee weapon. Uh, otherwise, it'll be able to attack you. Can I still uh, can I move back instead? One. Uh, yep, you can move back to where you were. Uh, or yeah, that's fine. Uh, I'm gonna shoot up my crossbow. Okay. So roll crossbow. Um, technically, actually, you should move a little bit further away. In fact, uh, because yeah, he's still he, he's you. Got reach. He can still attack. Uh, 14. Uh, 14, even with the, the losses to his uh, AC, he is not hit. Dang it. All right. I must hurt. Okay. Who's going to die now? Asuka is not operational yet. Do any of you, by the way, have anything to heal Asuka by chance? Like kill? Potion of cure light wounds, anything like that? Oh, I've got a club. I heard kill. I heard kill is coming. If nobody has that, we're gonna jump. Uh, yell me into the battle. Uh, uh, Kitty, I'll play. I have. <laughs> I have heal light wounds. Okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna, put, I'm gonna put Kitty in the battle anyway. I think. Um... <laughs> I don't even have to do anything. You can set yourself up. Perfect. Yay! <laughs> uh, you see where the characters are. Yeah, I know. Okay. And if you want to roll, uh, where do you want me to be? I was actually, gonna say, because uh, I shouldn't. Jackal's alive. Um, probably coming over the. We'll back. just say you just made it over the snowbank. Uh, like realize like you guys here? were missing, and then yep. Uh, hold on. All right. You were in the back long enough. enough. Uh, yeah, that's perfect. Oh hey, you caught up. Got up, he came back for us. Oh, oh, he did? I, I was Yeah. 20 on initiative, which will make mm -hmm. me... We'll let you go now. Might make <laughs> me go yeah. for Garazzo. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Go ahead. No, we'll, we'll let you go now, though. Like, enter the battle now. Uh, but I thought it was the Yeti's turn. Uh, it, it is, but I, I, since you kind of just jumped in, I, I'm going to go ahead and... All right, sure. I mean. We'll pretend I go. Because the, yeah, the, 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 just... the Yeti isn't aware of you. Let's call it a, another surprise round. <laughs> okay. Surprise round. <laughs> okay. Um, go up to Asuka and heal her. I okay. guess. Probably a good idea. <laughs> uh, we're level five, right? Uh, yeah, four. Oh. Uh, heal for 12. Good roll. So, so that I'm should, at put you at, should put you at ten because you were. I think you said you were neg negative two. You got to keep track of the yeah, negative 10. damage. So, uh, when they stabilize, they automatically go to zero. So they oh, should really? be twelve. Oh, okay, there you go. Twelve. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> in, the, in the distance. <laughs> 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 okay, and that would make it Asuka's turn because you know Asuka. Yeah, you're the okay. queen also, and you go before the Yeti. Am I close enough to use fire breath? Yes. Just try not to keep okay, huh? not try not to get anybody else in the uh, the blast there. 
Um, if I move forward, would I still hit the cat? Uh, no. Okay. If I if I standing if I'm standing where I am, do I still hit the cat person? Standing where you are, you will uh yes hit the cat. Uh, well, either them or Elbel probably. Uh, I'm gonna move forward. I'll move. Yeah, you'll you'll hit one. You'll hit, you'll hit one of them. Uh, so yep, move forward. One and then I uh, will... well, I'll assume you cast your spell first, so that's fine. Oh, <laughs> I I cast my wait I cast my spell. No, first, no, no, don't don't worry about it. Just move forward and do your thing. <laughs> that's fine. Or, what? I can uh, yeah, just just move one forward and and your spells cast. That's that's not a problem. <laughs> okay, then I spend. Where is it? Um, let me scroll down. Where is uh, fire breath? I just roll it, right? Uh, nope. Then how do I... Let me look it up. Okay, so uh, once round one round per level. So four times, or, or at least four rounds anyway, uh, or until you use all of them. Uh, you can breathe fire as a standard action. So you cast your spell already, so you can't breathe fire on this turn, and you can't attack on this turn. So that'll be next turn you'll be able to use that. Okay. But at the very least, you have the spell ready. Oh, I want to fly <laughs> to the little baby. Where is it? Okay. Anything else? That should probably be it. Call. You're up. What? Oh. All right. I think I'm going to move up a bit. All right. And then. All right. So the heavy crossbow. Doesn't work. Uh, you slightly broken. Well, you, you know it, it's it's working. You fired it. Uh, it's not loaded currently. You'd have to spend a, an action to reload it, I believe. Um, um, well, it's still broken because it never hits. <laughs> I'm bl I'm blaming it, not me. Um, but I'm just gonna so I'm just gonna cast Jolt. Okay. For one d three. Okay. Wait, I don't think. Wait, will that go? That? Will that ignore armor class? Um, usually, yeah, uh, depending on what the spell says. Give me a second. All right. Uh, Jolt is 25 feet, Spark of Electricity. Uh, it's a ranged touch attack, so you will have to attack, but it's against his touch armor. Um, so yeah, you'll be able to. If you do that, you'll, you'll roll your ranged attack. Um, Perfect. Uh, roll, roll ranged attack first. Oh, yeah, okay. Not your crossbow. Uh, um, actually, ranged. It's above. It's in the CMBs that we were doing the other day. Oh, it's above that. Um, I I don't. Oh, oh. Okay, I above. Think I see it. Yeah. yeah, it's like yeah, directly I above your it. weapons. You'll just roll ranged, regular ranged. Uh, that will not be enough to hit. I am useless on this battlefield. Well, I, I just realized I, I skipped the Yeti's turn with all that commotion, but oh well. Uh, Yelmir. <clears throat> Should have been a silly. Wait, did you skip the Yeti's turn? I, I I accidentally did, yeah, but oh well. Can I take the the, the, uh, the bleed damage? Uh, yeah. Take the bleed damage. Every damage counts. <laughs> okay, you'll need. Reading. Okay. <laughs> I'm learning this on the fly. Mm -hmm. Not a problem. All right. I can touch an ally and grant a lucky presence. Okay. I am. Um... Who's been trying to do more damage here against the Yeti? Um, I'm going to give it to Asuka since she's just up front. So basically what I'm doing is on your next attack, whether it be um, 
Ability check, attack roll, saving throw, or skill check. You can roll twice and take the better. Oh. Yep. That's cool. Okay. Yep, so that's on your next attack. And that's and... it, unfortunately. That's going to okay. use up my action. Grezzo. Still pretty injured. Um, or there's not much he can do. I'll just move him up a little, but still in like not fighting. Mm -hmm. And you're flying, so what height are you flying at? Max, <laughs> as well, high as it can go. Okay, so about 40 feet up. <laughs> yeah, okay, Aslan. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to move back. Okay, if you move more than five feet, just so you know, he will be able to attack you. Oh, he will? Yep. <coughs> uh, I'll... Are you still going to use that for? Yeah. Okay. And so he's gonna... I was going to... He's going to attack. Okay, uh, he's going to attack first, so hold on. Uh, does 17 hit you? Pretty sure it does, right? Yes. Okay, uh, 10 damage. I'm rolling extremely well. Like, you guys should, like, be the GM of my campaign. <laughs> I seem to roll really well against you guys, like, every week. It's okay, hello. You guys will pay for it. Come next time. Yeah, probably. Nothing was worse than me critting. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now you're going to roll your uh, attacks, Aslan. Ow, that hurt. There's your luck. Okay, even with the minus one to his AC, he is not going to take a hit. Uh, he can roll twice. Wait, no, 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 that's ice no, cut. Never mind, sorry. Cut, yeah. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure that ends your turn. So, Albel? I move up, and um, can I cast Grease right on him? Uh, you can, sure. Um, I'm not sure that's going to be uh, very effective, but uh, well, it's up to you. Yeah. I'm not sure how familiar you are with your spells, but... Uh... <laughs> what does Grease do? Just greases him up? <clears throat> that uh, makes a floor we... slippery, so when he moves, he can slip and fall. Oh, uh, okay. Well, anybody in the area can slip and fall, really. But doesn't that kind of... If he slips, uh, he skips his turn and does no damage, right? Uh, well, he can still attack uh, and stuff. He takes penalties for that, and he takes penalties from your attack rolls. I move back. <laughs> um, let me see. I cast. Uh, actually I actually have a spell called Shield. I cast Shield on uh, Isika. Uh, Shield is a personal one, so that can only be used on your. Oh, it's personal. Yep. Yep. That's the same thing that uh, Kel was trying to do to you. <laughs> oh, okay. <clears throat> then, like, crossbow. Okay. Oh, uh, no, that's not going to hit. Uh, would you like to move? I'll just stay here. Okay. I'm turn. Iska, I believe you were about to breathe fire on somebody. Fire breath. Woo! 
Okay. Yes, uh, so, I'm not sure. Let's take a look at that again. What do I want there it is. for? Okay, so yes, uh, you're going to do roll 6d6 for me. Uh, do what? 6d6. Roll slash r space 6d6. Six. And she gets to roll what again? Just one of the dice or all of the dice? Uh, no, she rolls all of the dice because this one doesn't have an attack roll. Okay. It's only... Yeah, it's whenever she oh, uses just it attack. next time. Just attack. Yeah. Okay. It it's attack, be... ability check, skill rolls. It's one of the 1d20s. Oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah. So still 6d6? Six, six? Yep. Uh, okay. Yep, that's going to do 15 damage. Uh, no reflex? Uh, think under vulnerabilities it says I can't reflex under those, right? Ah, okay, so it doesn't matter. It cancels out, I guess. Pretty sure. Yeah, because it's a vulnerability and... Yeah, okay. any fire damage does max or does. User in your channel mm -hmm. timed out. It does double, or I'm sorry, uh, one and a half times damage, and he can't or can't use a saving. Okay. Okay. Uh, you can still shift. Uh, you can't really move that far though. But yeah, if you'd like to. She can probably. She should have probably five foot shift before she blew fire, because otherwise the yeti can try and get get her, couldn't they? Um. Yeah, he already used his attack already. Oh, okay. You attacked uh, Aslan um, running away. So. Wait, can I do vanish? No, not no. enough. No, because that's, uh, yep, you already did your, your attack or your attack branch huh? of the, the turn. So you're... And I can't move. Channel. Uh, you can move five feet. Well, actually, technically, you can move as much as you want. So, but you're probably going to attack again next damage? turn, so you probably don't want to go too far. Yeah. Um, can I, I can move here. I'm going to move here. Yeah, because you still have three more fire breaths left, so or two more fire breaths rather, so not sure you want to go too far. Moving here. Okay. Okay. Okay, the Eddie spins around after that breath of fire and attacks Azica. It just won't die. And also, I just um, realized Yomir is like all the way down at 11 HP only. Oh, uh, yeah, he should be oh, uh, all the uh, way up because of the. Or he should be minus. Well, actually, no, he was up with the other group, so he's he's at, he's at full. <clears throat> uh, yep. So a 20 hits your AC, I believe, right? Asuka. Ninja. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just keep on thinking I'm dying again. <laughs> like, okay, you're gonna take six damage from his claws. I'm sorry, we can't hear you. You can't hear me. Yeah, no, we can't. We can't. Okay. Yeah, no. No. Yeah. Okay. Call your turn. All right. How? Okay. I'm trying to think. What can I do without attacking the yeti? Because if I attack, I'll waste my turn. Um, you can run by him screaming, <laughs> and trying to get his attention. All right. Um, what's my diplomacy looking like? Okay, that's not gonna work. We're back. Um. What if I, um, can I, do Yeti speak? Uh, what'd you roll on that knowledge check? I think you rolled an 18, uh, pretty sure, you're pretty sure 21. They, you're pretty sure they don't. Oh, that's right, you had. All right. Um... Oh, I like the idea of running by screaming, but I can only move 10 feet. <laughs> well, if you're running, you can move up to 40 feet. Uh, okay, then. Um, and, and he'll probably be able to attack you. But oh. It's very nice um, game. Huh. All right, who... Okay, I think we need... Um... 
You know, no, screw it. I'm just going to cast Jolt again. Okay. Do you, do you have it written twice? Um, what? Do you have it written twice? If you have it written uh, twice, I have it written it. four times. Oh, well, there you go. Yeah. Weak attack. Nope. Uh, no, a seven is not enough to hit him. Go figure. Well, I don't suppose I can still move a little bit. Yeah, you can move up to ten feet. Yep. All right, I'm going to hit dice. strategically uh, fall back. The size of the monster, if you will. Like, uh, how much... Like, you roll hit dice, for example, you would roll hit dice for... Uh, the number of level you have. So, you, you, like, you're level four, you, you have four hit dice. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Uh, Yomir. Uh, question. Which yes. one is Yomir's secret weapon? The Kopesh or the Chakram? Uh, his main weapon is the Kopesh. It's, uh, like a... doesn't have any reach, but it's his melee weapon. Uh, Chakram is his, uh, ranged weapon. Uh, but which one is his secret weapon of his deity? Uh, I'm pretty sure you picked the Kopesh. Okay. Uh, even though technically Desna's secret weapon is the chakra. <laughs> oh, is it? Oh, okay. You might, it's you might technically supposed to be, but um, let me triple check. It's not on the character sheet. Because the thing is, depending on which source you go to, it says differently. Let me see. Yeah, her favorite weapon is supposed to be the star knife. Okay. Yeah, and the chakra like, bait. Okay, a little. Yeah, because it, it, I think it didn't uh, apply in his case or something like that. Like he, he was really sending well, Kopesh. Uh, and... Okay. The thing is, he can designate a weapon as a sacred weapon, and I think he might have done that for the Kopesh then. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Um, it was, I'm pretty sure there's a Kopesh if it was anything. Okay. If it was a close trash, is the flaming weapon already enchanted on there? Um, no. No, that's, oh, I think okay. that's, a, so, that's a swift action, I think. So you, you can't do that. So. Okay, I see. Um, well, it's either a plus one or a swift action to... Yeah. You can also replace the plus one with a, um enhancement bonus. Um, mm -hmm. In that case, I will go ahead. Uh, move me up one square to the Yeti, and I'm going to attack him with the Kopesh. Okay. Uh, no flanking, no power attack, additional hit modifiers, I believe, no. Nope. Uh, 16. 16 will hit with the minus 1 dexterity that he has. Okay. And is the damage supposed to be 1d8? Uh, Even though it's yeah, supposed it's... to be based off of... It was thing is, one it's... tier above, but you know, the, the, we talked about that. No, actually, no, it's, it's whatever it is is reflected in the weapon already. Right? So... Okay, so even Whatever if it's, even the, if the sacred weapon damage is actually lower, we just go by yeah the kopesh yeah. because it's higher. Well, I I think if there if it was bumped up, I think I put it in the in the weapon damage itself. Yeah, the thing is, it's bumped up, but it's because I think let me see. Yeah, because we, we read that extensively. I remember going through that a lot. So we uh, whatever that weapon damage is, it's accurate. So you would just roll the regular okay. weapon damage. So just uh, damage roll. Mm-hmm. Two. Two. And uh, I guess I also get flaming, right? Uh, yep. It's one d six, or one actually in this case it's one d six plus one d three. Or just roll one d six and then times one point six or well, one point five, I think. So that's fine. So nine. <laughs> Eleven all total. Okay. With that hit, the Eddie reels over a little bit. He's still standing. He's still coming after you, but he's definitely injured. Grezzo. Uh, he moved there. Okay. He screams in his... Um... Wait, is it a demon, or is it what? I forgot. It, it just screams in his language. We're gonna die. Okay. Does anybody understand I, I, him better than himself? Nope. I was gonna suggest like rolling an intimidate, but I don't think an intimidate's gonna work if you're uh, that no, can we do unconfident. Can we check to see if we picked up what he said? 
<laughs> uh, no, unless you speak Abyssal or Infernal, which I doubt you do. <laughs> 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 yeah, the rest of them are like, "What the hell is he saying, Abel? You guys don't want to hear it." <laughs> Eslin. Okay, I'm going to. <laughs> That's funny. Move over here, and I'm going to try to use my javelin again. Okay. Please don't hit me. Uh, nope, not enough. Elbow, I believe your crossbow is unloaded. You can spend an action to reload that, cast a spell, run up and attack. It's up to you. Uh, does a light crossbow have to do that also? Pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure all the crossbows have to be loaded. I pick up my crossbow from the floor from stomping on it because it didn't work last turn. <laughs> <laughs> and I load it. Yeah, like crossbow. Loading a crossbow is a move action that provokes attacks of opportunity. Okay. Uh, can I still cast something? No, so it's, no, so it's a move action, so you can still attack with it. I'm sorry. Yep. Oh, I can still attack? Um, yeah. Then... Uh, 10 yeah. is not enough. I continue stomping on so, it. I was going to say, as a free action, do you want to throw it into the ground and start stomping on it again? <laughs> yes. Hopefully I'll fix it. What is he trying to do? Don't break it. <laughs> fix it okay. by stomping on it. Mm -hmm. Asuka, you have two more fire bears left. They don't do quite as much damage, but... Uh, let's see... I will kill it. Slay the beast. I will choose to use my. Just use your rapier oh. and roll twice. <laughs> Take the matter. <laughs> oh gosh, I was gonna say magic. Don't waste the t but... don't waste the luck I'm giving you. Okay, okay, yeah. the rapier, the rapier. I will take the rapier. I will put shocking grasp on it, and I will use the rapier. Okay, so you're gonna move forward uh, to do that. But yep, yeah, you can do that. Five. But, uh, mm -hmm. Oops. Five. Um, what do I roll? Okay, so you already use the shotgun grasp. You get to roll your rapier attack. Oh, uh, there's my rapier. Looking for my rapier. Oh, oh gosh, it was a. Uh, guess... Do I do yep. attack roll, damage roll, crit? Uh, you do attack roll. Uh, roll again. Attack and input value. Just um, submit all zeros. Yep. Yeah. Mm, yep. You. And roll twice because you want to take the better. Okay, let me roll again. Uh, where are you, Rapier? Zero, zero. Come on. Oh! That's a crit. That's why I tell you to roll it better. Uh, roll again so to confirm yeah, the crit, Roll the same guess. attack again. Confirm it. Kill it. Uh, same attack roll? Yep. Okay. Okay, that's a crit. Ooh, that's a double crit. So roll again. Again? Mm-hmm. Oh, God. Go, Asa, go. Well, I'm stopping on my crossbow. Oh, and there's also shopping grass on this, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. Ah, oh, no more crit. But shopping oh. grass. Okay, so it's a single crit. Uh, you're going to be rolling 8d6 plus the weapon damage. But in order, to save, in order to save a little time, he's dead. Yeah, I think the what? fire breath would have. He's dead. Came he's close dead? to dying, but yeah, he's dead. Woo! He's dead, and that I is no longer a living yeti. Mm. I don't know. Maybe uh... she could have rolled all once. Just roll damage anyway. <laughs> uh no, it's the one. It's the one. No, 
Okay. Right. It's, got, it's got four health. Back up. It had four health. <laughs> no. Are we out of um, attack? Yeah, we're Yomiya out of... Yomiya will put okay. away his weapon and ask if anybody needs uh, heals. I'm gonna <laughs> reload my crossbow. <laughs> I'm still in, in position. Garazo rushes to uh, Yomiya. <laughs> oh. Looting speak. time. Can I call for... His... Well, I don't actually know. That's it. What, what did he have on? What time? First, let's heal up. Seven. To grass, I should get eight then. Does anybody else need heals? <laughs> It's, it's tradition. Are you guys coming with the rest of the caravan? No. <laughs> Wait, I thought there was a. Uh, well, I thought there was a uh, landslide. Yeah, the rest of the caravan is kind of out of sight. Uh, also, Yelmir, you can't really cross that right now. Um, why don't you roll a uh, perception check real quick, everybody? Anybody that's interested. Interested right. in. Um... Perception time. Okay, that's good. That's really good. <laughs> Wait, let me just perception. That's good. <laughs> Everybody, I don't think anybody see very me. clearly. Um, <laughs> why oh, couldn't uh, I wrote this good back then? Yeah, uh, El Bills is two minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> it's like everybody suddenly from? has this revelation that something really bad is about. Uh, dang it, we're wasting what? it right now. Uh, <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Someone please screenshot this. As it, as it. Oh. 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 <laughs> Combo breaker. Raven. Let's not tell us about it. That was remarkable. If any of those were attack rolls, he would have died long ago. No, no. As Lynn can see, my Raven can't. <laughs> Girls, my crossbow on the, on the on the ground continues stomping on it. Why, God? Okay, so you you're pretty confident that touching the snow in any way, shape, or form is going to cause another avalanche. This this entire area is about to come down, for the most part. Uh, your only real option is to head uh, north or up the mountain, uh, as that's the only pass that seems to be like empty of snow that won't uh, cause an avalanche. Okay, well, you know, yeah, everybody going that way to, before anything I, happens. I don't have to think about it. I don't have to think about that twice. <laughs> and and as we run, we make so much of a ruckus that the avalanche happens anyway. <laughs> Wait, guys, did no one tell Aslan? Wait, does it bury the Yeti? Uh, no, 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 the Aslan Yeti's there. Knows. It's the bird that doesn't know. Yeah. <laughs> Aslan? Oh, Aslan jumps high. The bird proceeds to touch the snow. 